my friends qualifying has just started here we are at Suzuka but not the full layout it's the west chicane layout and it's round three of the USF 2000 championship brought to you by the limit of adhesion well, organized by them and I am struggling I am really struggling with this layout well, I think a lot of people are finding it difficult but my lap time is uh, atrocious So you got this is the joining part connects one part of the circuit to the other so oh, the game is glitching a lot there hope it's just people's paints loading in well I should remember them all got 15 here today and in practice I think I was 11th or 12th something like that Now we've got the version with the chicane in, which is probably where I'm losing all the time. I'm trying to drive it through there too quickly. Uh, so, target for today really is... If I can get an 8th place, I'd be happy. I think that's what we're trying for, 8th. In the first race, then that gives us a good chance of getting some decent points in the second race. I just want to beat the points that we got in the first round. I can't remember how many of that was, but it wasn't many. As we didn't score any points in the first race, I think, in the first round. A toe probably helps actually, but decided to get some clean track. Let's just take it easy through here to start off with. Try and get a time on the board. I'm never that confident through spoon corner. Oh no 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 no. Oh. And someone is coming. Let's see if we can get going before they get hit. It's not only does that ruin that lap, it ruins the next lap. Who's that? Is that Eric? Yeah, Eric's back for this round. Let's put the relative up. Don't want to get too close because this lap isn't going to be anything. Next car is nine seconds behind well, normally the only time I'm well when I'm behind Eric normally something happens like I spin or crash so Right, let's get through Spoon better this time. That's better. One minute nineteen point nine six eight. I think I might have driven this years ago, the circuit on something like a spec racer forward. Mm. 
but it's been a long time. You can cut that quite a lot. That's probably as much as you can take. Uh, and it's very easy to get slow down there. Too hot. Hard to get out of it. I think our lap there was quicker than Eric's. We seem to be a tenth closer. We're on the board. Just need to work on going quicker now. Slow car up front, or car that's looking up. I overdrove that a bit. I'm surprised to be in sick. Oh, we've spun it again. That's all right. The lap is longer than you think it's going to be. How much time have we got left? Not sure if we're going to have time to get two laps in. And then I blow the entry here. No, so I think this is going to be our last flying lap. Currently we're sick, I'm surprised at that. One minute, We're one thousandth of a second quicker than James Pepper. Well, that pretty much ruins that lap. So easy to lock up there. Probably should change the brake bias, but I don't really have any to do that quick and easily you know, on the wheel. I'd have to use the, uh, the F button on the black box. Eric looks up. Yeah, we're not going to get another lap in. It's annoying, had we not spun, we might have done. Oh, we dropped down to seventh. James is putting a quicker time. One minute, 19.124. Not too worried about that. Do anything on this lap. That smoke. Who's that off? Oh, that was James. And it's easy to s spin it. Find the through there. I was doing seconds, but yeah, uh, a lot through there but uh, find it was given too much rotation so we're doing third oh where are we oh I'm on Chris there we go we're there uh, that is grid so we're starting seventh on that uh, maybe before we grid up just a few reminders here are the points that you get 
in this series, so top 15. So <laughs> we're going to get points in this one. Uh, here's the schedule. So after this one, we'll be going to an oval to Phoenix. Right. Okay. I think uh, everyone's on the grid. It's Chur that qualified first. Let's grid up. One to go. Next time by. Line up on the left side. So we're getting we full in pace up. To finish the race. Pit road is closed right now. I just think I actually probably rather be starting on the other side because then at least for the tight, the tight part, we will be uh, on the inside of those two tight corners that links uh, this side of the track with the other side. Uh, I certainly think you can make the time up in the first four corners, I think. Uh, for me, anyway. That's where, when I'm having a bad that that's where I'm losing it, losing the time. I'm bad through, as you know, through hairpins anyway, so I'm always going to lose time through the hairpin. So 20 minute race now. I think I'd be happy if we finish where we started here. Uh, but who knows what can happen. Actually, with that said, let's take that off and that off. Uh, yes, yeah, so I haven't done anywhere near as much practice as I would have liked to have done. Uh, I wasn't too sure if you've watched the last race in the championship. I wasn't too sure whether I was going to be making it anyway. So, uh, and my head's feeling a little muggy today. So, I get all my excuses in now. inside so we got Chris to our inside and Chris behind us uh, Gareth uh, hasn't made the race today so I am the only extra racing representative in the team teams championship but there are two drop drop weeks so you know that that will obviously be one of his drop weeks I'm rather hoping that the first round at Scuba is going to be one of my drop weeks. That's... But we'll see. Uh, it might not be in the end because you never know what's going to happen. I don't know how we're going to go. Are we going to go? We should be able to go. Double file through the chicane here. But in racing, I don't think you want to be going double file through there. So let's look at the times. We're over a second off pole. Uh, Chaw and Gavin, or Jules, is uh, have looked out the front row, row for uh, for their team. Mike's done. Mike and Ben as well, they're in the same team, aren't they? And we're competing with them in the championship. Get ready, going green. Uh, I don't know, is Alex here? I thought Alex was going to be here. Didn't actually check to see who all was in. Green, green, green. I think that's caught everyone out, that's. Oh no, I thought we got through it. Left side, clear on the left. Oh. You'll need a tow back to pit lane. Press and hold the reset button and we'll come and get you. Oh no.
Red flag. <laughs> I maybe should have held the brake, but... Oh, I got hit anyway. Oh, well, well, that's... Uh, I don't know how, how many are actually still running. Two, three, four, five... <laughs> Nine. Ah, oh, nine are still running. Oh, makes me feel like I shouldn't have bothered coming out. I don't know. Who? I thought I just got through there, but not quite. So what happened up here? Jules cut straight across, but not realising Mike was in the way. Then comes across and then takes me out. <laughs> oh, I don't know what that bit is. Oh well. Oh, but if we know if we know anything, second race from the back, can they always make up loads of positions? Yeah. Some have already got out. We're down in 13th. I expect we're going to either be there. I can quickly check. Did Alex make it? That's it. No, go. Oh. Jules probably just be letting us having it because of that incident. Oh no! Cold tires. Slow car ahead. Car stop on the right. Go right. Go right. So we now lost seven seconds of them, but at least we got one back there. The car in B1 just at the fast of lap. One minute eighteen point nine eight one. Fifteen minutes ago, so it's like a full race anyway. We're twelfth. Well no, we're eleventh. Got a slow car on the right. Who was that? I didn't even see a car. Oh. 
Was it Ben he's got going again? One minute, 19.41. So Gavin's past Steve. So he probably catches up soon. annoying I was the fastest car and now the car behind me is the fastest car on that curb. Lost a few tents there. Spoon completely wrong. Ah. One minute nineteen point two two six. All the time that we made up, well, clawed back a little bit, then lost in that one corner. on the grass.
No, I think I'm just not on it today, but we got a second race where anything can happen. Yeah, interesting, so that first lap incident hasn't affected Mike too badly, although he's just about to be passed here, so maybe he's got some damage. No point in me getting involved in this battle for uh, third place. So I think if Roberto puts the move in, it will help us probably. in the team's championship.
leader is running. One minute, eighteen point four three seven. Don't really want to compromise uh, Roberto's race here. I was thinking of passing into 130R, but that's such a terrible spoon corner. Looks like pretty much everyone's going to finish the race. Track is starting to feel really nicely rubbered in. Gonna set our fastest lap, I think. One minute eighteen point six zero nine. That was your fastest lap of the session. It's dreadful performance by me, absolutely dreadful, but it's, it's not going to change what we're going to get. And had we not made any mistakes, we may have only finished. Oh, Jules has just got Ben. We might finish three positions, two positions ahead of where we are. But we're going to be at the back in qualifying. I think this allows us to take it easy in the next race. Sorry, we're going to be at the back of the next race. Ticket flag, ticket flag. Bring it back to the pits, we're going. Yeah. Uh, there we are. Let's have a look at the results. 
There's some good performances there. Well done. Roberto coming from 15th to 3rd. That's uh, <laughs> that's probably the drive of the race. Uh, annoying that Eric was just behind us in qualifying. And he gets second because he got through cleanly. Uh, there we go. So Gavin's apologised. Uh, I mean... I'm stupid because I made like three mistakes in that race. <laughs> uh, dear. Uh, shall we have a look at all that happened in that one? Shall we? I mean, we've seen the, the start. Oh. I think had I just moved over a little bit more we would have been off to third. Uh, yeah, uh, I don't know what these guys back here Yeah, so literally everyone. Who was the who was the sensible one here? Steve, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So Steve straight up into P three there. Oh, almost throws away, Steve. Uh, Chris coming back to pits, but he's got no rear wing. No, oh, we've got a warm up now. James clips the grass, I think. This is where Jules loses. It doesn't show my spin. Is Ken spinning it there? Is this the same thing? Or? No, this is another. Another it. Part two, I think. Yeah, the peppers. Oh no, <laughs> no. The teammates crash. Steve spins and James got nowhere to go, really. Steve spins. Oh, that's it. Didn't show mine. Ah. <sighs> Uh, yeah, yeah. I don't know how long. So it's only a five-minute qualifying. I forgot to uh, actually. Why I'm here? I, I need not, not there. That doesn't show what our tyres were. Uh, I need to turn something down on the graphics settings. Uh, We want objects. Let's put that as low. See, see if that does. I can't remember which one has the best gain. Uh, yeah, and I, I forgot. I was going to show you what the standings were after the last race. Uh, I'll see if I can go go and find. But I think I'm I'm sitting uh, fourth in that. Uh, let me see if I can, yeah, I'll find it on the website. Uh, let me go to web page. Okay, so this is the limit of adhesion website. Standings. Standings, yeah, so we're sitting fourth. 109, two races. Nico isn't here. Alex isn't here. So it was an opportunity for me to get up to second. Uh, Sebastian's not here as well. Uh, and Eric can catch us up. He's only done one race weekend. Uh, 
It's a bit of a missed opportunity, really. In the teams, I think we're third, although this doesn't, the teams doesn't work yet on here. Uh, yeah, so that's how we're standing, but with a uh, 13th place finish. Oh, time to grid. Oh, did we finish 12? Oh, what happened to Ben on that last lap? You must have got a penalty. So with a a 12th place finish, four points, which I think is what we got on our first race in the first round. <laughs> Something like that. Anyway, let's grid up for the second race. Next time, line up on the right side. Pit road is closed right now. Well, of course, Chaw doesn't want that. Now he's starting in eighth. <laughs> Might get involved. Now we know we've got James behind us and Ben. Chris is starting to our inside. Probably don't get the opportunity to back off as much as uh, I was planning to because I thought we were going to be last. So yes, I wonder what happened to Ben in that, on that last lap. Well, probably the ultimate map. Yeah, I think we've got to be patient here because there's bound to be an incident, a big incident at some point, I think, on this track. With the tight turns there are, like uh, the first two turns, the two Degners, Chicane, and uh, the hairpin. Oh, it was James sitting well back. I prefer being on this side of the uh, of the uh, the two columns to be on the right hand side. It gives us the inside to the two sharp corners. What we have to remember is cold tyres, especially through the hairpin and the chicane. A big factor. So we've got Ken on pole, followed by Philip and Steve. Uh, looked like Ken did well on that first race, apart from the, I think it was two spins we saw. Uh, yeah, I don't think we need to rush this race at all. I just got to try and be patient and race within myself. A green flag went quite early because it caught everyone out. About to go green. Stay focused. Which I think might have been what caused the. Uh... Okay, so Ken's right up with the pace car. It's... Pace cars are going in now. Green flag, green flag. That's interesting. You get green flag before the pace car goes in. Well, let James go. Yeah, there goes one, Go two. Right. Oh no, not again! Ah! Oh. Go 
You've got some damage. Let's get that fixed. Oh, well, this is turning into a round to, to forget. Oh, there's bad prediction code there. I think Jules gets in the break. Oh, I should have just come to a stop. I didn't think Jules was coming back on. My car's tailed. I'll be the only one to wreck out. Looks like we are. Oh well, still a long race. Steve, we're watching you, Steve. <laughs> uh, let's go have a. Where's Ken now? He's still in. He's still in first place. Oh, he's got a bit of a gap on Mike, but we know Mike's quick from uh, how he qualified. So he's got through. Philip is holding on to third, so that's good. And Chris is quite quick, so in fourth, it's going to be a good race between everyone. Can we get out? before the pack gets here. Oh, they get stuck because I so slow and get in. Okay, punch it. The car on your left. Clear on the left. <laughs> Left side, you got a slow car on the right. Car what? stops on the right. Clear on the left. You got a slow car on the right. Car stops on the right. Car stops on the right. Car right. You got a slow car on the right. Clear. Oh, it's on off. So we need Ben to put a bit of pressure on Jules so we have to let him pass with the blue flags. That said, I think he's now losing Jules. Sorry, Ben. I'm going to have to go for it.
We are last. Those are started. You got a slow car on the left. Didn't see a slow car. But there's one coming back towards us. Jules is pulling away. Oh no, what's happened to Ben behind? He's now lost the position to Steve. So Mike is now in the lead. wasn't sure if I was taking too much grass there, so I got out of it. The leader is running one minute eighteen point six nine four. Not as quick as I was in the first race. One minute nineteen point one three nine. The car in C Losing them in front. So the whole field is not too far ahead of us. Ten minutes to go. They can still all sort of catch each other. Oh, Eric's up to third. Good week for him. Okay, so they're battling in front of us. That 
might slow them down, hopefully. The car in C4, just set the faster flat. One minute, 17.885. One minute, 19.047. Always going for the pass. And gone defensive. Oh, he's gone. Car on your left. Clear. Wasn't really paying attention to what happened there. Too busy looking at my own <laughs> apexes. I wonder if they both got damage out of that. I don't know. Minute 19.093. The car behind is pitting. Oh, okay, yeah, they both got damage, I think. We've got Chris seven seconds up the road. <laughs> oh, no, eight seconds. We've been here before in race one. Oh, he didn't pit behind us. That must have been Jules who was saying he pitted. Is James going slowly? Slow car ahead. Well, he definitely is now. <laughs> the car in P3 was that James? Must be. Oh, Jules up to third. Three seconds. He's got enough time to do this. for position that one. I'm not as quick in this race, I wasn't I haven't been paying attention to track conditions where the track is warmer. I think we're, going, we're relying on Chris Slow making a mistake. Here. I think that was the wrong Chris that made a mistake there. That was bad. Bad 
that. The batch is going. Yeah, I'm well off the pace then, aren't I? I mean, I think it's only Chris that we can catch. Really? That was a long lock up. Cast off on the right. Oh, that's Ken from third place. Is he damaged? I think he is. He's going slowly on the straight. Right side. White flag, one more left to go. One minute twenty point three four five. to settle for 11th. So I think this is going to be our worst performance of the season so far. So we're going to try and hope that this will be our drop week. <laughs> But then with an over week next week, you never know what's going to happen in those races. There we are. 11th this time. Okay, we'll get them next time. Probably stopping on near the apex of 130 yards, not a good idea. Uh, bam. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, Mike won there. Sure, second. So well done to Mike. Uh, that's a good win. 
And Eric comes third. So Eric's had a good weekend. Chris fourth. Kem fifth. He does resurrect fifth from third place. Maybe you might have been having a battle with Eric. I don't know. Uh, let's have a look at all the wrecks there. I just want to go back and just see. Oh, this is E1. For some reason, E2. Uh, where are we? We're back here. Yeah. So what actually happens up here? It's just just a bit of prediction code into Roberto. I think you have to remember what you need to remember is Roberto's got a high ping. So Chor gets through that. Yeah. Um, and that collects us. I just need to be. I thought I was past it, but I wasn't. So that breaks our car. Chris gets collected in that. So here, oh, this is what happened. James gets joined together with Chris. Oh, there's a big prediction code there. Oh, the damage is way too much. <laughs> I got nowhere to go. And from that, Jules gets back past us. I better leave it. Let's just pass again. So that holds us up. James spins it. Oh, too much curve there from James. Oh, Jules gets it all wrong. Oh. I, sorry, I don't. This uh, this is a new driver. I don't know how to pronounce his name. So, is it Pavel? Is it W or V? I don't know. Or Paula? Yeah, it's a difficult one. That one, isn't it? Jules got it wrong, and he. I don't think there's actual. Is there? Contact. Yes, front wing just hits the rear wing. Uh, <laughs> uh, Yeah. Managed to find it both both times. <sighs> and there we go. Uh what happens next? Steve I mean it's everyone's favourite place, isn't it? The chicane. Oh, James is broken. Does something happen to him? No. Yeah, he's definitely broken. And that's probably what, why he then loses it here. Or oh, maybe just a bit too much curb. Oh, that's why I hate that curb. Oh, poor Ken. It's just a self spin. He was in third. 
there. That's a shame. It would have been a good result for him. He will be good next week on the ovals. He's very good on the ovals. And then Mike with the donuts. There we are. <laughs> Chalk gets out of the way. Let me go and see if the results are in. Oh, I just realised I left the uh, web page up. Uh, where's OBS gone? There it is. It was an 1853 strength of field. Uh, so for that final race, we come home in uh, 11th. But well done to Mike, Drew and Eric. Uh, in terms of pace, this is what I want to see. We, we got down to our best that was 18.5. So you... We weren't as consistent as Gavin. Uh, oh, we got almost the same that time. There. Uh, but, yeah, we... There weren't many that were like, uh, Chris was quicker. But there weren't many that were. So I think that was a bit of a missed opportunity there for us. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this one. Thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you again soon. Uh, next week, no, two weeks time we'll be at Phoenix. I'll see you there.